Hello and welcome back to Doom 2 on the Ultraviolence difficulty. And I am now on the 8th part and I'm about to enter level 18, the courtyard. Now I'll just point out that the exit is in the starting area, God knows why. But to exit this area I need to shoot that, to kill the zombie man, run past all the imps and get every enemy alerted. So I'm going to grab the yellow skull and then run around the prim well, kind of the perimeter of this area twice. Get that monkey bus alerted. Just run around to avoid everything twice. And yes, I'm going to do what I did in suburbs and make most of the enemies die through infighting. I need to get every enemy alerted, so I'm going to alert that. I don't know what that pink is doing on that wall, well, pillar, and I don't want to know. <laughs> but hopefully he's out of his cage now. Not literally a cage, but oh well. So secret one is by taking this teleporter, and then I can lower this down. So I can jump off, leg it, just get everything to infight yet again. And get the BFG out and just put a few shots in. And yeah, I'm going to use it to good standards. There we are. And then I can finish these off with the chainsaw. Because as you can see, there's a lot of enemies, but it's not really that hard. It's not anything challenging. At all. As you can see. And yeah, here's four Paco Demons just to be in the fray. And I hope there's no enemies left around. And ow. That hurt. That really, really hurt. Oh, yes. Oh yes, it really, really hurt. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. It's a... Uh... Oh, Capo Demon. Yeah. And yeah, there's lots of health in the actual courtyard area itself. Because they're expecting you to get de absolutely destroyed by the enemies. And yes, there are stuff in there that I don't even need. And secret two in here. Oh yes, I don't know why it counts as a secret, but it does. So let me just whip the BFG out. And destroy two Kako Demons. Yeah, so that switch opens that back up so I can get out. And that's it for that side. And... I don't know what that revenant wants to do, but never mind. Yet yeah, there's two revenants as I opened up this, the alcove, well, kind of alcove to the second one, and the imp and the hell knight want to join it. Doing what? I don't want to know. And that appears to be near enough it once I find this imp that is croaking, well, imps that are croaking, I should say then. So. What am I doing? I need to get this uh, ready. And that was way too close. Yeah, so the blue skull key is in the fray here. going to collect a lot of health potions so literally I can now exit the level but I've still got bits I need to do what time am I on oh only four and a half minutes I could get this done within ten but then it don't matter about time does it no time is that is that not the essence so secret three takes me to an area earlier well in a different part of the area Secret 3 is a, is a different coloured 
platform, if you'd like, where that, um, it was like grass type area, it was a bit, it was a different colour. And yeah, so a lot of shotgun guys in here, so I can get good ammo back. And there were a lot of spectres. And yeah, I'm basically locked in here. It, it same applies if you go from that part and you run across. And the way to um, get out is to, because when you walk into this area, that opens up and this switch lowers it down. But because I came through from there, it didn't open up. So, oh. I like to go what the And yeah, now this pink is mixed in with the fray. Yeah, see the last fourth and final secret is in this um level as well, so Oh god die man. I know I've got a lot of ammo which I can pick up from these shotgunners, but jeez, there's no need to bring in this all the time. Yeah, so that's secret four, the chain gun in here. And yes, I am using the super shotgun. I just want to make sure everything dies, so that's secret four. I have to walk in to access the secret, if whatnot, if you'd like. So now I'm at the area where the barricade is, if you'd like to call it that. You call it whatever you want, whatever you like. This doesn't want to die, so now I've lost a chunk of health. Good night. So now to exit this area, I need to go back round into the teleporter. That don't need to be pressed again. But that side's done, so I just need to collect some health. Don't need the rocket launcher. Collect some more health. And the middle one's what I was in. So what I like to do here is grab the invulnerability sphere. Go over to the far one. Because it is in fact a trap. And I'm just going to use Berserk Fist actually. Because why not? Because I've got the Berserk, I know I did. And there is enough plasma in here to refill my plasma around, or at least I think there is. If there's not, I'm only, what, 40 plasma short. I doubt that matters. And that's one BFG shot. I can afford to miss one BFG shot. But that is um, courtyard completed. Practically. Just need to make sure everything is definitely dead. I just have to go to the final part, the soul sphere trap. You can only access it by grabbing the soul sphere. I don't think there's a way to clip the soul sphere without grabbing it and setting the trap off that way. So you have to pick it up for the trap, so I'll leave that until last. And then I'll just grab that for the sake of it. Go out here, collect this ammo. I didn't actually need all of this. Grab the armor and get the hell out of here. Courtyard is completed. 100% kills and item uh, kills and secrets, which I wanted. So I shall carry on to the citadel, and there is in fact a raptor and a raptor at the starting area to the side. And I made it eat my shells, eat my shotgun shells. Ha ha ha. This level isn't too bad like the courtyard. I mean, the courtyard looks bad because all those uh, come out and or spawn. But spawning enemies is not tough at all. Out when the going gets tough. Yeah, yeah, I'll stop. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Right, so I'm going to go back down here, grab that. I think that's all the imps dead around here. I'm guessing I can kill these now. Yep. Is that them all? 
Well, that appears to be it. There will be a few left. So I won't go in there yet, but I'm going to go around this side to make sure everything dies around the side. And I want to make sure I don't get stuck in the weird corner. It's like with a jagged edge, so that's not good. Oh, double kill. Double kill again, I think. It was a double kill anyway. Nothing beats the triple kill I got on the crusher though, because the three spectres all died within two. Because I must have weakened all three of them and I just got a triple kill because I lined them up. Real hole. Only if it was possible to kill all three of them with a double barrel shotgun shot without damage any of them and then kill them all in one shot each. Now uh, that would be sweet. Yeah, so this is the exit to get to level 20. Another famous level for what it happens. And yes, you need all the um, skull keys, but you only really need the red or blue or red and yellow. But I'm going to be collecting all three anyway, because I need to get try and get 100% kills and secrets if I can. And there are lots of items again. Yes, there have been quite a few items in these past few levels, as you can see. And it looks like I'm going to be blasting you with some rockets again. Yeah. That's what you call rocket to the face. And I'm sure there's two lost souls and a capo demon in here. And I forgot to press the switch. Never mind. What a wally. Oh dear. Now it's pressed. And now the capo demon's already came out. Always going to be coming out. At least. Here he is. Yep, with I think two lost souls. I don't know where the other lost soul's gone. Oh, there he is. Wah. I don't want to grab that yet. Not at least until these are dead. And I've used up a few other shotgun shells. Right, so I'm not going in the middle bit yet. Well, I say middle bit, it's like the end. It's like the back then, I'll say actually, the back of it. Secret in there, but I won't be going there yet. I want to go in here, make sure all the imps are dead. And then grab the shotgun shells. The shotgun. Now there's some pinkies out here, if my mind serves me correctly. Yep. Well, some, but two. Ain't got time for that. Yeah, it's a secret. I don't want to fall down there. That's everlasting death. See if I can make it then, shall I? What am I doing? Drop down there carefully. And then run up. Oh, dear. They don't make it. I never seem to make it on the first go. I think I've only ever done it once, if it even is possible to do it once, I don't remember. Probably didn't do it, but I think I did. Well, obviously it will be possible to do it once. Oh no, it's leading me out to the middle area. Looks like I'll be killing, I'll be kicking ass out in the, in the back. I keep on saying middle, but it's like the back. I know I thought there would have been a pain elemental in this area. Oh, just for the fact that there were loads of lost souls, so I thought the pain elemental would have spawned them. But no. Put them up, put them up. You're dead. How are you not dead yet, man? Oh, now you die. Yeah, rocket launch is good against them. I'm sure there's a double, the double barrel probably shotgun will do me a very good favour for part of this level and I always thought there was going to be a secret on here because I always looked to see if there was a different face on each side but yeah that's the um, back done for now and familiar area see if I can make it this time yay I made it this time but then again the pinky might have stopped me from running across and yes the supercharge but if you go in from this end, it sends you to a trap area type place. And these are already dead, so... 
Bon voyage! And I'll be entering this area for a different way, so I might as well go to this area. As simple as that. Now I need to change back to the super or soft gun. Where there's only a few pinkies. And then this platform will raise to the right of me. Oh! As you can probably see, yes you can see, and it raises this back up so I can run across to there. And I think I get the red key. Red skull key, yes. I do, that answers that. Right, so, I think this side is done and done. So I can go to this side. Oh, no. Where's the... Oh, never mind. I won't be doing what I need to do yet. So I'm going to leave that for now because... Yep. That opens up as a secret to get to the yellow key. Passing that bit opens it up. So I need to get in quick before it closes. And then kill off these mofos. And... He came over. Where, where did you come from? Where did you hide? Where did you come from? Where did you hide? And yeah, you can open it from that side anyway, so... Yeah, so that's where I've already been across here. I'll show you. Yeah, so I don't need to go there again. I can go it after going here now. Well, I don't have to, but because I've got the keys I really need. But it's time to cut them up, cut them up. Because there is in fact a, a one time only secret. I think it's one time only. It's like a pa platform that um, goes up once and once only. I think it's to get the blue skull key. I don't remember though. So it leads out to the back of the area. I don't think it is though. But yeah, so I'll go here. Yeah, so it tries to stop you from getting across. Uh, yeah, I need to get to that area a different way. It, well, it's not a secret then. It didn't. It didn't take me to where I thought it was going to. But never mind. Right, time to go this way into here, grab the armour, up into this elevator, put them up, put them up, I need to run across, don't fail it, yeah, there are five in here I think, two, four, once he's dead, and five, four, so, see I know some of these areas well, Loads of pistol men. Ah, yes. Just like the secret level where there's crap tons of them. And now it's the area where I need to be careful because this will kill me no matter what. So I like to do that to make sure. Oh, hello, Kako, I forgot about you. Yes, yeah, so I like to do that to make sure I definitely make it across. And I'll do that. Put two rockets in each of these sectors. It should be enough. Six was enough. Oh. And yes, this opens up. I knew you was there. I was waiting for you to come out then. So I think it's the top right which takes to the blue key. Thank God I got that right. <sighs> I don't know if any of the other ones are secret, so I'm not going to bloom in waste time trying to go in all of them just to check. But I'm guessing the middle one's a trap. Hopefully it's not a death trap. If it is, then well, I'm dead. And yeah, familiar area over there. I want to 
want to go in here for the blue key, so I've got all the keys now, but I ain't, it ain't over yet because I want to see if any of the other teleporters take me anywhere interesting. I'm going to go to the middle one, but I'm going to have the invulnerability sphere ready just in case there's a big surprise waiting for me. But I don't remember if any of them do anything special or not, that's why I'm going to get this out ready. Just in case there was a big surprise in the middle. Oh, it's just the middle bit. Now, I don't think there's anything special in any of them. No, there's nothing special in any of them, I don't think, so I'm just going to exit the level and hope for the best. Because I don't want to waste your time doing that. So, that is the Citadel completed. No, that's good then. 100% kills and secrets. Yeah. Two levels in a row. But those two weren't really that hard. And now it's level 20. Gotcha. And I have to immediately pause it because I heard an imp. Ooh, this one is famous because of the room. Well, the next room from where I am, where the shotgun is facing. And you'll see why. And it involves a certain type of enemy as well. Well, two certain type of enemies. And you'll be seeing them um, for the second time eating this game, I think. So that's a hint if you haven't played this game before. Yeah, it is. I've only seen them once each time, have you? No. One of them you've seen, you'll be seeing for the third time and one you'll be seeing for the second time. But enough of me talking gibberish. It's time to sign you guys off. So, I will thank you for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye.